With respiratory illnesses on the rise, hospitals are beginning to feel the pressure. And doctors warn with flu season getting underway, the situation could get worse. William Longines has more. A surge in respiratory illnesses combined with COVID-19 and the flu has doctors warning of a possible triple-demic. A virus known as RSV poses the biggest threat right now, mainly in younger children. It causes symptoms similar to the flu, such as fever, sore throat, and fatigue. Experts blame the spike in part on relaxing COVID precautions and a rise in indoor gatherings. We know that if you have two viruses at the same time, you are sicker than if you just have one. And we are seeing kids with three and even four viruses all at the same time. And I've never seen that in 40 years. Pressure now builds on hospitals. According to the CDC, about 75% of pediatric beds in the U.S. are filled. It hits our youngest population, like um, newborns and, and young toddlers, pretty hard. And oftentimes those kids end up having uh, difficulty breathing and need to be hospitalized for treatment of that. The agency says flu activity is also on the rise with Georgia, New York and South Carolina seeing the greatest spike in cases. The number of COVID-19 infections remains low, but in previous years, cases increased around Thanksgiving. That has doctors recommending COVID boosters and flu shots by Halloween to prevent severe complications. The only booster that matters now is this new booster that's kind of, um, you know, specified for the, the Omicron. The Biden administration says a vaccine for RSV could be available by next fall. In Los Angeles, William LaJeunesse, Fox News.